Hello all. Um, in the previous tutorial, we have seen how to import a, a PSPICE model to Unity Spice and then convert it into a symbol. Uh, so, example, we have seen that when we open this and try to uh, import a symbol. Um, so the the ones which we were, we imported were part of auto generated and then uh, this is what we see here so this is how the symbol of lm741 looked like right <clears throat> now uh, one of the major uh, problem with this is it is hard to understand which is a inverting terminal which is a non inverting terminal which is a uh, basically output power terminal and then <clears throat> The ground terminal or the negative terminal so it's very difficult to understand for us right now we will be comfortable using the a symbol which has an op amp in which looks like op amp rather than a square type so for this let us see how to convert this symbol into an op amp now if you see this is the uh, LT Spice library which is being used by the LT Spice application. So when we go to symbol, when we go to auto generated, so this is the symbol which we generated from the PSPICE model uh, and then edit with notepad <coughs> or whatever way you need. We are using notepad plus plus. So here if you see this is uh, uh, the uh, background uh, <coughs> script of that particular symbol now if you see here the pin attributes uh, which are uh, uh, looking like 28 50 99 the pin names are this way uh, which it which gives us a hard time to understand what need to be done now for this scenario uh, let us go back to the symbol again And then here in the symbols, let us see if already there is an op-amp symbol that is there. So there is an op-amp folder and we know in LT Spice there are several op-amps which we can use. So while these may not uh, may or may not match, let us take a universal op-amp symbol. So this is the universal op-amp symbol which we open. Okay. So now if we go back, let us open it, edit with Notepad++. This is how um, the uh, symbol background script looks like now this if you see here from here to window okay, so this particular one is what uh, the op amp symbol is just take this instead of a rectangle here use this here now the next things are nothing but symbol attributes as for m attr so for this symbol attributes uh, <coughs> we need not uh, uh, modify them because these are specific to that particular symbol so let us now go to universal of them and then if you see here there are uh, pin attributes right so let us take the pin attributes are nothing but the pin numbers and what they represent and what is the uh, pin name everything would be there so if you go back here you can replace this win till window from here this one so in plus in minus v plus v minus out that's what we talked right this is what we require so let us try to close this and save this now let us go to LT Spice. Let us cut this and then let us close the symbol also uh, schematic also and if we open the symbol you can see that still that instance of that uh, um, old symbol is uh, present so now let us close the entire lt spice application itself and then try to open a new instance of this application open a schematic and go here auto generated you can see here the symbol has changed so some people while modifying this uh, uh, script in the background uh, they don't um, restart the lt spice and uh, the symbol doesn't get reflected so now you can see here this is very clear which is an inverting which is an inverting which is an output so everything is clear if you want you can display the names of the parts <coughs> you can do many things around uh, so hope this is clear for you uh, and you can modify your symbols in lt spice 
as per your requirement import whatever uh, piece by symbols you want um, follow our previous video uh, to use the procedure uh, hope this helps you uh, if you uh, like our channel uh, subscribe to it and like our video thank you